Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. The four new Madrid earthquakes occurred from December 16, 1811 to February 7, 1812, and were described as the most powerful quakes to hit the United States east of the Rocky Mountains in recorded history. There are estimates that the earthquakes were felt strongly over almost 50,000 square miles. The first earthquake struck on the state December 16, 1811 in northwest Arkansas and caused only slight damage to man-made structures, mainly because of the sparse population in the area. Nevertheless, the earthquake caused the ground to rise and fall, bending trees and opening deep cracks in the ground. Landslides occurred along the steeper bluffs and hillsides, and according to some account, the Mississippi River flowed north for the few minutes with great velocity. The earthquake was followed by a powerful aftershock at 2.15 a.m. That was felt widely over the entire eastern United States. Subsequent earthquakes occurred on January 23rd and February 7th, 1812. During the last quake, the town of New Madrid, Missouri was destroyed. In Natchez, the rippling and crawling motion of the earth was plainly visible, though not so alarming as further north. I'm Cece McKinney, a sophomore at Cathedral High School, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.